having a good time. It's awesome. It's so awesome. And especially this day compared to last year. <laughs> it was a little damp last year, but this is absolutely fantastic. Crowd, you know, you can kind of feel a really great vibe in the crowd. And uh, this is this is, this is is great. And I have to say, I was saying to somebody else, this is not my usual Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> How so? Do tell. <laughs> Just in terms of the activity going on here. Now, right. you seem like an analytical guy. When it comes to betting on the Preakness or any race, what goes through your head? What are, you, what are the keys? What do I need to do? Well, it's interesting because we came last year and we spent a lot of time with Bobby Flay. Now, Bobby owns horses. He's on the New York Racing Commission. I mean, he's serious, serious about this. We didn't make a dime, right? <laughs> I mean, you can open that racing form and you can look at all of that stuff in there. And you can tell a lot about a history of the horse, but it doesn't tell you what he's going to do that day. <laughs> That's just... That none of that stuff is necessarily predictable. Yeah, right? A case of too much information. Right. So just tell me when to lose. So most of the time now we just say, "Well, oh, that's a funny name. We like that." So, right. man, that's from old heart. Well. Yeah, so, as, well. a, as a veteran broadcaster, what advice do you have for us? For as you we're guys. Here today? Well, I'll tell you what, Mindy. Mindy, in terms of fashion statements, this may be one of the great ones. I've seen today, <laughs> right? Because we're out here and everybody's all dressed up and they've got their good hats on and everything, and that's a good hat. But this. That's power right there. You no, know, you, you have can to walk around and wear that and not be self-conscious about it. <laughs> you're owning, you're owning your space here. It's right? all all to save the dress. It's function over fashion. I have to clip my mic somewhere, right? <laughs> I guess that's true. I won't I'm not going to pursue that or, or give you alternatives, but that sounds like I think I I hear exactly what you're saying. Hey, anything you're working on NBC want to push tell us about that might be coming up anytime? Oh, you know, I'll tell you. We've started this thing on nightly news now when I go out, we brand the stories Mr. Smith goes to and we've opened a little, you know, Facebook page and we're getting a lot of great feedback from folks about come to our town and tell us about, you know, tell this story or that story. So it's uh, it's been been a great time, and I love love working with Brian. And you know, listen, I, at my advanced age, <laughs> that that they still let me, you know, go out and tell stories. I'm 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 mighty grateful about it. Really am. Good to see you. Thanks, Thanks for coming by. You, Thank you so really, much. Really, really nice Have a good time. Have fun, but not too much. Win big.